Young Money get back to this. <laughs> oh god, how the hell am I going to start this? <coughs> <coughs> oh, not like that. <coughs> Hi. Hello. How are you? Oh, it's been so long. It has been, it seems like a decade <laughs> since I've last made a video. And I want to say that I'm sorry. I'm, I mean, I don't want to say I'm sorry because like, life just happens and I will get to that in a second <laughs> because this is going to be a long video <laughs> I can already tell that this is probably gonna be like a very informational video so sit back get some cotton candy some popcorn like some M&Ms whatever you have it and let's get to talking <laughs> I just want to say hello if you are a new subscriber I am Cat Wilderness it's nice to meet you kind of meet you through the internet little bit I don't know <laughs> I am 22 years old I just turned 22 on June 29th so that was very eventful um, I did feel old <laughs> I'm not gonna lie <laughs> yeah that happened a lot of shit has happened since I've last made a video and I can tell you right now that this is not my usual background and that is because number one I am NOT Nikita Dragon um, <laughs> But, um, thank you for me thinking that because of the door and the black hair and the trans and the makeup and I don't know. A lot of people have compared me to her so I'm like, I mean, don't get me wrong, that is a huge compliment because I love Nikita Dragon. What? I love me some Nikita Dragon. Hey sis, if you're watching, doubt it because I'm no one. But, if you're watching, hey girl, <laughs> how you doing? <laughs> so, uh, let's get, I have my list right here and I just want to talk about a few things that has happened since I've last made a video. So, first thing is I am in my own apartment. Um, I do have roommates, so that is why I am kind of on the low low like of speaking right now because it is <laughs> it is um, 404 in the morning and yes that is Cameron Dallas. Don't judge me. <laughs> Don't judge me, he is bae. <laughs> he is dad. <laughs> what? <laughs> if you don't know, get into it. But yeah, I have roommates right now, so, and they're probably sleeping, because they have regular jobs, and I'm gonna get into that later on, later on in the video. I have my own room, and I don't live that far away from where I used to live, where I used to make all my old videos. It's definitely a change. This is the first time I'm living on my own, which is crazy, which is crazy. Let's see, what else? I turned 22, I have a new apartment, um, I moved out of my mom's house because I was originally living in my mother's house. My job. So the title, as you could tell, um, I am a drag queen. Yippee. <laughs> um, I actually just got done with the gig and that is probably why, uh, if you look at my makeup a little bit, that's why I put these glasses on because I'm a little bit like crazy right now with the makeup because I was dancing and everything. Which I will get to that in a second, because I am not a stripper, I'm not a whore, I'm not a prostitute, I do not sell my body on the side, I am just a drag queen that loves art and performing. <laughs> but let me get into that, give me a sec, just give me one tiny second of your time. I have been doing drag for as, for like, no, since November of last year, last year was 2016, of November of 2016 I've really have been like committed of doing drag and like performing and now it pays the bills and it's crazy to say that I know because any drag queen or person that knows drag or just is a fan of it knows that it does not pay well and I can tell you right now it does not pay well I have had to work my ass off to get to where, where I am right now which I'm proud to say that I'm not big at all at all like who am I I'm like I ain't shit like who the fuck am I <laughs> but I do you know hustle and I know my hustle and it is good enough to um, provide a home and food and clothes and stuff like that um, so that is my job I am a drag queen and 
I have been, I, if you've noticed, if you subscribe to me, um, you've seen some of it, my videos. I've been uploading like, I did work bitch, which I will put in the uh, link description below. Here's a little clip of it. <laughs> And I did Boss Ass Bitch, a mix that I love because I that was like one of my like earlier performances, which I'll put a clip right here. Yeah, I have been just doing that and growing myself as a performer. I've always wanted to do this since I was like a little, little kid. Um, I've been in theater since I was like four, so like the stage and me like go hand in hand. It is definitely a, a very like situation to where like a lot of people like don't know what to like do because I'm trans and I'm a drag queen and they think that just because I'm a drag queen, I'm a man in a dress, I'm a cross dresser, that is not what it is at all. Please, and I urge people to do their research because, you know, a cross dresser and a transgender person or a drag queen and a um, transgender person is two, a cross dresser, a drag queen, and a trans, there's a lot of words. <laughs> a transgender person, a drag queen, and a cross dresser is very, very different from each other. All of them. Very, very different. So I urge people to go, you know, do their research before they're having like assumptions with me. Because Google, Google right there, we all have, we all have these, or at least we have access to the internet, like libraries or something, you know? All we, all you gotta do is do a simple Google and it's right there. So people, it, in 2017, we cannot afford to be this ignorant, you know? And that's my thing. Like, we have so much at our fingertips, literally. And even if you're, you don't even have this, we have, if you're watching this, you're on the internet, but you can just go on Google and search up every single question that you have and then know more about it. Which makes me very, very mad because people just don't want to do that and they just want to stay in their ignorant ways. Which I'm like, at that, that point, I'm like, that's, them and them, I'm me and I can't do anything about that and that honestly is also a real big reason why I haven't been making videos as much because I've been trying to focus on that aspect more or that aspect of my life more I definitely wanted to update y'all with what I'm doing and I definitely want to get back into YouTube but very very slowly <laughs> so another thing I wanted to talk about in this video is the relationship with my mom so it is crazy because as if you watched my coming out video, like the story time that I did, it was a long ass video. A lot of people has told me they watched it, which is crazy to think because I put that video out so I could just, you know, have it out there. I could vent, I, you know, very great, very grateful that people responded to that video so well. I talked about my relationship with my mother and at the time it wasn't that great. And now that I moved out, and I think that we've had our space from each other because we've lived for, with each other since I was like 14. And um, <clears throat> I, I can't believe that, you know, for the longest time our relationship wasn't great. And the fact that it's amazing now. She's come to one of my shows of drag and it's crazy to think that because from when I've come out to now, I would never, ever, ever think that that was going to happen, ever. <laughs> so the fact that that did happen, I want to let y'all know that it is better and that things actually do get better. I wasn't a believer of that at all, <clears throat> at all. I will be the first one to tell you I was not a believer of that. And I'm grateful. I'm grateful for the relationship that I have with my mom now. So let me get back to doing drag. Um, doing drag has been the most amazing thing that has ever, ever happened in my life. Ever since I was a young kid, like I said, that I've always wanted to be a performer. So the fact that I'm doing it and it's paying the bills and I'm out on my own now. It's only been two months, I'm not gonna lie. So I'm like very, very treading, I'm like not jinxing it, but so far, so good. It's been a 
it's been a flow and the hustle has been nice and I want to thank if anyone is out there that has booked me or will book me or has supported me or has tipped me or it's just been genuinely nice and like complimented what I'm doing and seeing and appreciating the, hu appreciating the hustle. I want to say thank you so much because I see you, I love you and genuinely I love you and I am grateful for you. <laughs> and I just want people to like understand that like drag is an art and I'm not a prostitute and I'm not a whore or stripper or anything like that. I just get on stage and I lip sync to a five minute song or like a six minute mix because it. I love to make people happy and I love to entertain people. That's why I do YouTube, that's why I'm on social media, that's why I put myself out there because I like to entertain. And that's what I genuinely feel like I was born on this earth to do. So, you know. I don't know, I can only just be me. So definitely, definitely make sure to subscribe and hit that bell button to be notified when I make new videos and yeah, you'll be probably be like surprised because out of nowhere you'll just get a ding and be like, oh, she actually posted a video today. <laughs> Look at her. Go her. Staying on a schedule. Look at that. <laughs> okay, so I will see you in my next video. Stay classy, stay humble. I forgot how I did my outro. It's been that long. <laughs> All I gotta say is I love you guys from the bottom of my heart. Thank you. I love you. And I will see you in my next video.